This is an instructional video for the use of the Billy Goat OS901 SPH self-propelled overseeder. As with any Billy Goat product, review the operator's manual provided with the unit and also available at billygoat.com before use. When operating the equipment, use gloves and eye protection. Tip, mark sprinkler heads and valve boxes prior to use as the blades can damage them if accidentally run over. To prepare the unit for use, take it out of compact mode by flipping the folding handles up making sure the set rings are above the hinge. Once the handle is in operating position, drop the set rings so that they lock the handle. Reverse these steps to put the handles back into compact mode. To set the seed drop rate, review the chart located on the upper handle for the seed being used. Move to the front of the machine where the drop rate indicator is located and adjust the rate by loosening the jam nut, rotating the drop rate indicator to the desired setting. Then retighten the jam nut. For best coverage, it's recommended that the seed drop is set at half of the recommended amount and the overseeded area is covered once, then covered again at a 45 degree angle. To start the engine, position the on off switch located on the front of the engine to on and pull the choke lever back to choke the engine. Pull the rope to start. Once the engine starts, push the choke lever forward. Pull the throttle back to attain full RPM for seating operation. To adjust the depth of the slit, loosen the lock nut and screw the depth knob to the left for more depth or to the right for less depth. Tighten the lock nut once the desired depth is set. Tip: Set the blades so that they scuff the ground no more than one-eighth of an inch. It is recommended to first run the unit in a test area to attain proper depth of the slit. Grass seed is to be planted at a maximum depth of the seed width planting deeper waste seed as it cannot germinate properly. Drive controls are featured with forward on the right and reverse on the left handle. This is a hydrostatic drive unit, so the less you squeeze the drive lever, the slower it will go, and the harder you squeeze, the faster it will go. To drop the blades into the turf, step on the foot pad at the rear of the machine and push down on one of the foot pad ears to unlock it. Step on the foot pad to pull the blades out of the turf. To engage the cutting blades, fully depress the red lever on the left handle. When the cutting blade is engaged, seed drops automatically via the auto drop feature. The unit can slice and drop seed in both forward and reverse drive. 